wolves over there feasting on that horse? Brutality and beauty are both all around us. Yet so often we're unable to see past our own grievances. This is what I try to teach my son. Yeah! Go on, get out of here! Good. There was no need to harm them. Hello guys, welcome to part 51 of the Red Dead Redemption 2 walkthrough. So in the last part, we helped Sadie get her revenge on her skulls for her husband's death. We also took a promise from her that she will help John and Abigail escape once all of this is done in the gang. So, we also looted some dead bodies and also killed a few cops because they were apparently trying to arrest us. So we were not going to go down without swinging. So we killed every single cop on our tail last, in the last part. <laughs> so anyway, let's continue on our mission. And... Oh, that's quite a distance we have to travel. Alright, I guess you don't have a choice. Okay, the mission is from... The next mission is from Rain's Fall. I think he is an accomplice of Eagle Flies. I think, I don't know for sure yet. That's a nice shot. We should use Jedi for hunting as well with bow and arrow. It will make our shots precise when on the horseback. Let's tow it on the horse. If you guys like the video, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, share the video with your friends. Tune in daily for new gameplay videos. There are still bodies lying around from the last mission. So let's loot the remaining bodies, shall we? We can't leave any loot over here. They have some good loots on them as they are old skulls. Some platinum rings, gold rings, stuff like that. It is still on them, I suppose. There is nothing coming up on our screen that what we have looted. Okay, finally. Okay, all of these bodies are looted already. So, I think we have looted everything here. Let's check this cabinet. If it has any money inside it, oh yes, there is some jewelry inside it, some coin, a coin purse as well, nice. I'm glad we checked here. Let's search a drawer, nothing in here, let's search another drawer, nothing in here as well. Let's go upstairs to see if we have missed anything from last part. Okay, I think all of the stuff is looted over here. So let's continue and let's meet Mr. Rain Rainfalls. Hmm. Quite funny name there, Rainfalls. Okay, some rifle cartridges. That's nice. Let's see what we have over here. Oh, nothing. I thought there was a money clip on their bench. Okay, I think we are looted everything. Let's go meet Mr. Rainfalls. Yeah. 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 
Jump horse, jump quickly. Let's not hunt the moose right now because we don't want to go with the moose skin on our horseback. The moose skin is quite heavy. So, oops, better be careful here. Our horse can easily trip and we can go flying off its back. Let's try to climb this mountain over here. Okay, there's a wanted area, wanted patch here. Okay, okay, easy horse, easy. No need to freak out. Just ride carefully. And these mountains, oops. How did the horse survive that fall? That is good, but I'm surprised because. We have been thrown off the horse back like this several times. When the horse jumps quite a few high. Anyway. Okay, we are again in the big valley. We have to cross this mountain for sure. That much I know. We have to cross this mountain somehow. Oops. Okay, the horse cannot climb <laughs> straight up. Oops, come on, come on, come on. That was we. There we go. Okay, let's not take any risk let's fall back to the main road and follow the road <laughs> from now okay this is the road quite narrow roads in the stretch of the mountain But at least there are roads here. Hmm. We stomp that deer under our feet. What happened? No need for fancy talk, eh? Raise your hands now. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Trying to rob us. Why would we surrender? <laughs> the game is stupid enough to give me that option to surrender. Did you see anything? Okay. So that is one flaw in the bounty system. <laughs> The guy clearly saw us beating up that man but did not say anything or no witness for any crime. So how is that? I am a little bit confused over here. Because as so far as the bounty system that we have experienced, that should have been the wanted level right there. The man clearly saw us beating another man. <laughs> <coughs> Okay, we have entered a legendary animal territory. Once we complete the story, we will also do these <coughs> legendary animal hunts. For sure. Alright, I'll see you guys at the destination.
Almost there, horse. Don't do it on me now. Stop throwing tantrums around like that. You have stamina in you. Alright, welcome back guys. So we have fast forwarded <laughs> to our destination. That was quite a long ride. From a starting position to here. So anyway, let's meet Mr. Rain Flies. Sorry, Rain Falls. <laughs> okay, let's let our horse rest a bit. Oh my god. What? Come on horse. Why are you falling on such stupid roads? The horse should be able to climb this. Come on horse. What's the matter? Just climb the mountain. <laughs> okay. Let's try to walk over here. Low and steady does it. <laughs> That's nice. Alright, guys, welcome back. So, we are fast forwarded to our mission location. That was quite a long ride to here. Okay, we are at the, I think we are at the local camp of Mr. Eagle Flies I suppose we cannot use weapons here ok just like our camp <laughs> I think we are meeting the chief of this tribe over here Let's see. Hello? Come in. <coughs> you don't sound very well. I'm not. I'm, I think I'm dying. And I hope you find peace. I don't know too much about peace. Apparently not. Thanks to that raid you carried out with my angry son, he is now in jail, apparently awaiting death. Um, uh, I'm sorry. I suppose I lack the grandeur of a conventional king. I don't know too many kings. Colonel Favors, he has already exacted some measure of revenge for the raid. Two women were assaulted by his men. Um, I'm very sorry about all of this. Yes. Sometimes the correct path, the bravest path, is the least obvious and also the gentlest. I'm... I'm a great disappointment to my son. Your son seems to want a war. My son thinks there is glory in death. Maybe he's right. But for me, I saw death being handed out so freely by the most foolish of men, I never could equate it with victory. Glory has come in service. Maybe. Maybe not, I don't know. I've killed a lot of people. For a whole lot of dumb reasons, and I ain't never seen much glory in it. Well, your friend Mr. Vanderlyn, he talks a lot. I don't know him, but my son is easily lit. I'm not sure I get you. Uh, well, perhaps we could go for a ride. I'm an old man. My whole life I have tried to bring peace. But uh, I ain't doing so good. Then maybe you can take pity on my plight. Please, it won't take long. <coughs> maybe I can 
help you with that cough. Sir! I'm glad yeah, I called you, sir. Say? Captain Monroe, do you know my friend, Mr. Morgan? No, sir. I don't have the pleasure. Arthur Morgan. It's an honor, sir. How can I help you, Captain? I was just in San Denis. I spoke with the mayor. It's not good news, I'm afraid. May I ride with you for a little? Of course. Follow me. So where are we going? I want to show you a site up in the mountains that's long been sacred to me. A place for reflection and healing. What is this news, Captain Monroe? Yes, sir. As I mentioned, I did speak again with the mayor and the Bureau of Indian Affairs in Saint Denis at length. But regrettably, it appears the oil company has already received approval to move forward with drilling on the reservation's land. I suppose as much. So what does that mean for us now? I'm not sure just yet. I didn't get the impression anything would be happening for a few months. I'm very sorry, sir. I did everything I could. I know, Captain. And I assure you I will continue to do as much as I can. Mr. Morgan, would you have time to help me at all? I would rather certain actions were taken by friends outside the tribe. Sure, I can help. That's good news. Thank you. Come meet me on the reservation whenever you can. Sure. I'm sorry to be forward, but there's so much to be done. Anyway, gentlemen, I won't take up any more of your time. I'll see you both soon. Sure. Thank you, Captain. Enjoy the ride. See? What's left of that bridge over there? I heard about it being destroyed. Do you know? If that was all No, I did that too. No, I'm pretty sure he had nothing to do with that one. Well, I fear they will find a way to blame it on us anyway. We'll continue on this way. I'm going to look for some herbs to give you. See the wolves over there feasting on that horse? Brutality and beauty are both all around us. Yet so often we're unable to see past our own grievances. This is what I try to teach my son. Yeah. Go on, get out. Good. There was no need to harm them. Easy by easy. <laughs> I can't believe we just did that. We just scolded the wolves like a dog. <laughs> and they listened actually. Flies and the reason for his arrest? In part, yes. I think you know something of Dutch by now. Yes, I know enough. Charles will find a way to help Eagle Flies, but I worry that won't be the end of it. Dutch seems hell bent on making your son's fight his own. And <sighs> sorry, uh, hold up a moment. That'll have to wait. Some of the plants I need will be growing down here. Alright. Red and Patsy is helping us. As well. making your sons fight his own and well, this ain't easy to say but I just don't trust he's doing all this entirely out of solidarity what else does he have to gain from it uh, I ain't quite sure yet he's kind of unwound right now I 
just thought you should be aware. I appreciate you coming to me, Mr. Morgan. Let me give this some more thought. Things that bad on a reservation? Yes. This conflict with Colonel Favors and his regiment at Fort Wallace continues to worsen. Many of the elders are sick, and the young feel that any compromise is an admittance of defeat. Well, we ain't done much to calm the situation. But I have to continue to seek to resolve matters through peaceful negotiation. War would be futile. Your people are lucky to have you. I'm not so sure about that. Beautiful view from the top of the Mississippi Mountain. Wait, I must stop say. here. I want to pick some ginseng. I thought that we could brush him a little bit, okay, but boy. we can't. It seems. Wait there. I'll put these in your saddlebag. Thank you. <clears throat> Mix these together. It tastes awful, but it'll help to keep your strength up. All right, let's go. It's not much further now. I appreciate the herbs, <laughs> but I think it's going to take more than that. <laughs> I saw a doctor and. He says I'm in a pretty bad way. I'm sorry to hear that. This situation we're in, me, Dutch, and the others, I don't know how long I got, but some of them, they still got a chance to have a life. I'm just thinking, if I could give them that, then maybe this ain't all for nothing. I think there is much you can still do, Mr. Morgan. That's quite a steep mountain we have here. We have to ride slow over here <laughs> because if we don't ride slowly, we will fall down so much. <laughs> <coughs> I like the background music <clears throat> on this mission. What's happened? No, it can't be. No, they destroyed everything. No, I need to find the Chinupa. Who would do this? Someone who wanted to enrage you. Help me look around, please. The Tanumpa is gone. Cool. That is one clue. What is it? A uh, ceremonial pipe. There must be some clue as to what happened here. Peace. Sure, look 
looks like they was doing some drinking. I see no end to any of this. There is another queue on top of that. Come, take a look at this. Oh, the bottle is floating. Graphical <laughs> glitch. Well, if they drank all that, they couldn't have gotten too far. Oh, well, still no sign of the Chinooka. We have two more clues to go. Army flask. Whiskey. <laughs> Bastards are having a party up here. Okay. Let me give this some more thought. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Quick, Mr. Morgan! There's someone down there! Do you have any binoculars? Sure, I have them all the time. who did this Are you surprised this happened <laughs> not at all but but I hope we were past this well you got land they want land with oil they moved us here they've taken everything we had I signed three treaties myself and they've broken each one no, they've taken the last hope. No, my people are going to want a war. A war they can't win. Not if I get it back. Get it back? Yeah. I'm going to go in, get your chin up, and no one will be any the wiser. Let's go on our house, shall we? It will be much faster, I suppose. Of course, we can't. If you could do this for me, I would very much appreciate it. Yep. Yeah, it's easy. I have to just go there and ask them nicely to just hand over the Chanupa. And if they don't agree, I just I have had to take it from their dead bodies. Guy over That was a close one. Where are you from? Me? I'm Polish. From Milwaukee. Hmm. Hell, fuck! We got. Oh, you dare 
Shit. There we go. I know that was not necessary, but we have no choice. Okay, let's uh, find this Kanupa and get out of here. Okay, we found it. But let's loot these bodies. They will have some good loot on them for sure. They are soldiers after all. Yes, I know, I know. I will trim it. Just a moment. Search this chest. Maybe we'll find some jewelry. Yes. <laughs> Poison arrows recipe. Nice. Some arrows as well. Yes, this was quite profitable. Looting over here. Okay. I think we got it all. So let's return to Red Falls and give him his artifacts back. We will be very happy to see those. I am sure of that. Come on Arthur, run! I did. Here. I, uh, I got your things, I, I think. Yes. Thank you. I'm very sorry about this. Even sacred things are only things. People, the heart, matter more. Was anyone hurt? Yes. It's a bad business. I should not have let you do this for me, but perhaps it will stop a bigger massacre. With these, maybe I can calm my people. Maybe I can calm my son. I hope so. Thank you. Take those herbs I gave you, please. And most of all, I hope you can find peace within yourself. So do I. Damn those drunk bastards. Bloody army men. He's a man who, not so long ago, I would have found weak and pathetic. Now I see as wise and thoughtful and sensible. I would love to help him, or at least stop Dutch pushing his son to do something real stupid. All right, mission is complete. Okay, where is our horse? Back at it, boy. Let's take him for a swim so that we don't have to brush him. <laughs> Alright, guys, so let's stop there for this part. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, share the video with your friends. I'll see you guys in the next part. Peace.